Hello friends and my dear students welcome back to my channel Phoenix Physics today we are going to learn Van de Graaff generator it is nothing but an electrostatic generator designed by Robert J Van de Graaff in the year 1929 why do we use Van de Graaff generator because it produces a large amount of potential difference up to several million volt that is 10 to the power of 7 volt it works on the principle of electrostatic induction and action at point look at the diagram here a hollow metallic conductor is fixed on the insulating stand this is my insulating stand here I have two pulleys B and C pulley B is fixed at the center of the spear and pulley C is fixed at the bottom the belt made up of insulating material such as silk or rubber runs on both the pulleys it connects both the pulleys that is B and C here I have two comb shaped metallic conductor fixed near the belt here pulley C is driven continuously by electrical motor so pulley C rotates in the anti-clockwise direction here comb D is connected to the power supply which supplies 10 to the power of 4 volt potential difference or voltage due to this voltage high electric field is created near the comb D so air between belt and comb gets ionized so positive charges pushed towards the belt and negative charges attracted towards the comb because due to action at point positive charges are in comb D air between belt and comb get ionized so ions formed like this positive charges are pushed towards the belt and negative charges are attracted towards the comb so positive charges stick on to the belt and move up like this comb E is fixed inside the metallic conductor when the positive charges reach near comb E a large number of positive and negative charges are created on the either side of comb E due to electrostatic induction as a result positive charges are pushed away from the comb and reach the outer surface of the sphere these charges are uniformly distributed on the outer surface at the same time negative charges are nullified by positive charges in the belt when the belt descends it has no net charge again it gains positive charges at the bottom goes up and delivers more positive charge on the surface of the sphere this process continues until the outer surface reach the potential difference of order of 10 to the power of 7 volt we cannot store charges beyond this limit since the extra charge starts leaking to the surroundings due to ionization of air to avoid that leakage we should enclose the conductor into gas filled steel chamber at high pressure what is the use of this van de Graaff generator you know that this generator produces a large amount of potential difference up to 10 to the power of 7 volt it is used to accelerate positive ions for nuclear disintegration and other applications i hope this video is useful to you if you like my video, please share and subscribe my video. Thank you.